The Bible was not refuted so much as it was outgrown. The Bible's worldview was built on local metaphors and tribal horizons, a flat earth, a short timeline, a handcrafted humanity, a primal pair, a borrowed pantheon, a vertical morality. Each of these models made sense in an ancient world where the sky looked like a dome, the ground seemed endless beneath the feet, and the boundaries of knowledge were defined by what a village could see or imagine. In that world, above and below carried moral weight, and the Bible's categories felt sufficient. Science did not kill the Bible with a single blow. It destroyed it piece by piece by expanding human perspective beyond its limited categories. Geology and astrophysics stretched time from thousands of years to billions. Evolution embedded humanity into the same tree of life as all other organisms. Population genetics shattered the myth of a single founding couple. Comparative mythology exposed Israel's God and angels as cultural recyclings, not divine revelations. Astronomy and cosmology replaced a three-tiered moral universe with an infinite, indifferent one. The Bible was not refuted so much as it was outgrown. Its models became too small for the universe we discovered. Its framework fit only as long as we didn't understand. The more we begin to understand, the less it reflected our reality. We are transitioning from local metaphors to universal knowledge. Above and below once felt intuitive, but only on a flat earth. In a universe where direction is relative, space is multidimensional, and life is not the center but a byproduct, the old categories collapse. Religion remains bound to its local metaphors while science universalizes. The cosmos does not conform to scripture. Scripture shrinks before the cosmos. When science destroyed the Bible, it did so not by attacking faith head on, but by rendering the Bible's worldview obsolete. What once seemed like revelation now reads like provincial myth. What once mapped the cosmos now looks like a child's drawing of the infinite. The universe has outpaced the book and in doing so has shown that truth is not found in clinging to ancient metaphors, but in expanding with the horizons of knowledge. Science didn't just challenge isolated doctrines. It exposed the entire biblical framework as too small for reality.